The Witherstorm must have the coordinates of all of the uh, former members. Okay, just a little farther. Wow! Someone really went bonkers with the defenses, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh. Yeah. Oh. Who goes there? Oh, Jesse? Is that you? Lucas, did you build all of this? Well, yeah. I, I figured I would try and fortify the place, you know? <laughs> nice! I'm so glad you're back. And we brought Magnus! Fantastic! Quick, come on! You guys are never gonna believe who showed up while you were gone. Yay, she made it! Petra! Hey guys, how's it going? Petra! You made it! It's good to see you too, big guy. And it's really good to see you, Jesse. Back there in Gabriel's bunker, it got pretty dicey. It's such a relief to see you. I'm glad you're okay. You pulled me out of that Witherstorm's crutches, and I ran and ran and ran for the temple. If you hadn't saved me, well, I owe you everything, Jesse. I'm just glad I heard Gabriel telling you where to go. Did the Witherstorm leave anything? Is anything left of our home? It's all a blur, but the weather storm left almost nothing behind. Everything, everyone, was just gone. It even got Gabriel. Wow! Been a while since I've been here. Whoa. What is she doing here? Call this a hunch, but do you two not like each other? Right. Um, I forgot to mention, Olivia went on a little <laughs> expedition of her own while you were gone. So no matter who you Olivia choose, you get both. Came back with her? Did you know about this? Did Eligard put you up to this? You think you know a guy, and then, bam. And this is a problem? You bet your butt it's a problem. No way am I working with her. Not after... <sighs> Jesse, Jesse, look, I found Eligard. Just hang on a sec, okay? I'll go figure out what's going on. Good, you do that. Easy now, Olivia. Let's try and play it cool, hmm? So, who are you now? And why did you bring him with you? We are reuniting the Order of the Stone. It was kind of crazy, actually. I went to Redstonia, and there were all these incredible engineers and inventors. It was a little intimidating, actually, but Eligard's made me her protege. Well, assistant for now. I mean, after what happened. I know, I'm sorry. So sorry. Well, I'm the king of Boomtown. Very impressive. She might have, well, embarrassed herself a tiny bit. Yeah, but after I pled my case, she agreed to take me on as her assistant and come back to help. Not bad, right? Oh, hooray! It's Ellie, and here I was just starting to enjoy myself. Hello, Magnus. Your voice is exactly as pleasant as I remember, which is to say, not at all. Oh, my feelings. Is that the same wit you're gonna use to save the world? Why? You're here to tell me how to do it better? Oh, I would never dream of doing that. Unlike you, I actually do things instead of just talking about them. Hey, that's Eligard you're talking to. Show her some respect. Wow, you finally found yourself a live one. Hey! Would you all cut it out? Holy crap, you're all acting like crazy people. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. Yeah, I'll admit, that thing looked real nasty. And I've seen some nasty stuff in my time. Too much for you, was it? 
Your usual brutish approach didn't cut it? Hey, you weren't there, all right? You didn't see how this thing just tore everything up. Would you two stop fighting? Whoa! Yikes. Jesse's right. We need to find some way to stop that thing. I don't know if you've looked around yet, but this place isn't nearly the stronghold it used to be. Most of our supplies are gone. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Are they getting along? Can we start crafting some then? I don't think we got that kind of time. But even if we had all the TNT for miles around, I don't know if it would be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie, not this again. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. What are you talking about? What did Soren have? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formidabomb. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F-bomb before. Yeah. F-bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F-bomb could destroy anything. This thing sounds Im impossible. How could it even exist? Impossible objects were Soren's specialty. We don't know where Soren is. But you found us. Do you know where he is? Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the Nether or the End. But, it's worth a shot. He wasn't on the map. Hmm, let's see what Lucas has to say. How are you say. holding up, Lucas? I'm alright. This has all been pretty intense. I feel like if I think too much about what's been going on... Well, I'll just think I'm completely nuts. Thank you so much for all the help. I, I know we haven't always gotten along the best in the past, but you've been so great. Wow. That means a lot, Jesse. Thank you. He's a cool guy. How are you, Petra? Fine. You okay? We can talk about it later. Let's just do this map for now. Hello, Eligard. You said you know how to activate the map? I'm very curious to see it. I've never actually seen it work before. Yeah, we're going to talk to everybody, hey, then we're going to activate so how it. How are you doing? I'm hanging out with Magnus. I'm doing awesome. Glad to hear it, buddy. I do like his generally upbeat attitude. Hey, Magnus. Hey, small fry. No shame in admitting you can't turn that thing on. It's very, very sophisticated. I'm going, I'm going. All right, all right. I know right. what I'm doing. Okay, let's go ahead and turn a pedestal on. Yep, got to go do the levers. Just like last time. Oh, oh, maybe I have to go around the other side this time. Oh, let's talk to hey, Olivia. Olivia, you okay? I'm all right. I can't shake the feeling that I embarrassed myself back in Redstonia, in front of Eligard. I think she kind of judges me a little bit. It'll be okay. I hope you're right. There we go. Okay, it looks like I can only click this one. All right, there's your light, my light. That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, 
He invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. Glad we can agree on that at any rate. I mean, I never actually went there with him. Then let's stop hanging around here and go get us some super tea. Whoa. It didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Blue? Blue? That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move! It's not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Perfect. We can wait till tomorrow morning and travel with a full day's sunlight. Uh, and risk that thing catching up with us? I think I've had enough wither storm for one day. Uh, thank you very much. Right, because getting caught out there in the dark is so much better. Trust me. If you had seen this thing, you wouldn't want to stick around. Trust Let's get moving. Me. If you had a brain, you'd want to minimize our chance of being caught out in the dark with all the monsters. Yep. Yeah, I don't want the wither storm catching up with us. We should go now. Jesse here is talking a lot of sense. Let's just go with that plan. You're just saying that because it's your plan, but fine. Okay, everyone, let's get moving. Jesse, right? Oh, hello. We haven't had the chance to acquaint ourselves properly. I hear that you saved your friend Petra from this wither storm. Sounds like you're a pretty impressive individual. Picks fights with lots of monsters? Always defending the weak and defenseless? I'm just <laughs> doing my best to keep everyone safe. I can always appreciate humility. I like you. In any case, I sort of wish that you had taken my side earlier, but water under the bridge and all that. A slight tangent, what's the uh, deal with your friend Olivia? I appreciate her enthusiasm, but she can be a little much sometimes. She's always very eager to jump in and help, which is sweet, of course, though sometimes I wish she would think a bit more before jumping in. I don't know if you caught this, but... She's like your biggest fan. You probably just make her nervous. That's an excellent point. Hadn't thought about that. Seems like you respect her a lot. Why didn't you listen to her plan to come and recruit me? Not to make it awkward or anything. Or to demand, why didn't you want to recruit me? <laughs> I figured that we needed firepower, and no one knows destruction better than Magnus. The man does know how to blow things up with reckless abandon, that's for sure. I'll do my best to not let it hurt my feelings. <laughs> joke. That was a joke. Oh boy. Yep, exactly what I worried about, and exactly why we should have waited till morning. At least the wither storm isn't tearing us apart right now, alright? Catch all that out later, because we got some monsters to fight here, people. I can see the wither storm behind us. It's gonna be light soon. We're gonna be okay. Man, I miss daytime. How far is Soren? It has to be close, right? Not much farther. We can make it. And we made it. <laughs> 